Today, I'm going to talk to you about this special thing that happened last year. Two very special people on your wedding day. I said this is to Raina and Randall. Believe in yourselves as individuals and as a community. Protect each other's dreams and be gentle with each other's hearts. Smile and laugh and enjoy. You're beautiful. Your wedding is a beautiful day. We start with an amazing day together. Congratulations. We should move the very best. You're waiting for the free, so I read that star free. Why are you me crying? <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. That's it. Really? That's why I wanted to give it to me. That filled up the heart. Yes, I did the wedding for free. Absolutely free. No charges at all. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Nitin. I'm a wedding and portrait photographer. How many times in our life have we felt that if someone would have helped us in a particular situation, the overall circumstances of our life would have been different. So before we begin the video, let me tell you a short story. This couple reached out to me in September of 2022. They reached out to me through my website. I replied their email and then we got on the phone and discussed the details. I shared my portfolio, they liked it and we were all set to capture the wedding. So during our discussion, Brad also requested me to meet one day ahead of time at the wedding venue to understand things in details, see what the location is, how the lightning is in, where the wedding is going to happen. As requested, I reached out on the location before the day of wedding. We meet bride and groom, we discuss everything in details, everything is set. Normally I get well along with my clients, we discuss details about our life, our experiences. That's where I come to know that the groom is a veteran and had just finished his services from Iraq and he was where he was posted for 10 years, it was a very long time. Both the couples met when, they, when the groom came here. They wanted to start a new journey and they wanted to get married. The groom was from Mason, Ohio and that's the reason why they wanted the wedding here in Columbus. From Columbus, they were about to start their new journey in Colorado and they were very tight on budget. This was a very mini wedding, just the bride's parents and groom's parents and they wanted to save something to start their new journey in Colorado. I sensed they are in real need of some help and as a photographer, you know, the best thing is to do give them free photos which will probably make them happy and they can cherish this memory for a lifetime. So normally I take chocolates and greeting cards from our bride and groom whenever I go. I give them ahead of time before the wedding starts but for this wedding I waited for the wedding to be done. As soon as the wedding was done, I went ahead, pulled out the box and gave to them and there it is. They were happy. The bride literally cried, the groom literally cried and I was, I, I had tears in my eyes looking at them. You know. And what better feeling than making someone happy when they are starting a new journey. I have got many lessons in my life from my grandfather, from my friends who have helped me along getting till here, you know. I'm grateful for what I'm doing today. There has been help during my initial stages when I was starting this photography and I wanted to pass on to people in need. In last couple of years, life has not been easy for everyone. It's been tough, it's not been easy. We are trying to do whatever we can. If there is a situation to help someone, go ahead and help them. That's why I did it. I hope you like this video and take along my message who needs help. That's it from now. I have also created an album for them. I'll be sending them this as a surprise very soon. And I hope this makes them happy. That's it from this video guys. Uh, I'll see you in the next video very soon. Till then enjoy the images from this wedding. I hope you like it. Take care.